The Trinidad and Tobago Police Service is seeking clarification on some terms mentioned in the Anti-Terrorism Amendment Bill. They say some of the terms are ambiguous. Acting Commissioner of Police Stephen Williams and some members of the TTPS sought to get these terms clarified for their better understanding of the legislation. They made the recommendations at the Joint Select Committee on the amendments to the bill. Shirley Lewis reports. The TTPS is asking for clarification on the word threats as it pertains to the term being used in the anti-terrorism bill. Kazim Ali of the legal unit within the TTPS said, the term as it stands is very ambiguous. Ms. Dali said threats, as outlined in the bill, can mean a number of things and if enacted, it can cause some confusion for police officers in the functioning of their duties. The offense of threatening, of threatening terrorist act can be properly and successfully um, prosecuted. We also required a, a definition of the term terrorist act in any legislation that deals with terrorism. The pillars that formed an act is a proper definition. Acting Police Commissioner Stephen Williams shared similar sentiments. So we're not saying that. Um, we were just highlighting one particular area, the area of threaten, um, to be specifically reflected in this piece of legislation. But it's just a suggestion. Mr. Ali said the definition of a terrorist act is also vague, and he asked the committee to look into that. So for a definition of terrorist act, we need a concise, we need something that is unambiguous and comprehensive so that if an offense make reference to a terrorist act, we can go back to the definition and pull from that. Sherilyn Lewis, C News.